So my next guest is Jim Strauss. He's uh, Vice President of Sales at ACM Research. Uh, welcome, Jim. Thank you very much. Happy to be here. Yes. Now, we had a really interesting chat last year uh, at Semicon West, and uh, you're obviously in the, the cleaning business, and uh, you had uh, a number of new things going on. But since then, the company's expanded quite a bit. So let's start off with that uh, and talk about some of the expansion into China and Korea and other places. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's talk a little bit about our history. So we started... David Wong started the company in 1998. Yeah. Um, he's been really, uh, you know, a, a great um, growth story since about 2005. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, 2017, uh, we did a stock listing on the on the Nasdaq, um, and the again the company has continued to grow and expand. Uh, over 50% a year over the the last seven years. Wow, so uh, we're, we're very, uh, very satisfied with that. Um, our next opportunity is to expand outside of Asia, um, specifically in North America and in Europe. And that's what we're working on right now. Right. But but you, you just recently uh, opened that place, uh, an R&D place in, in Shanghai. Is that yeah. correct? Yeah. So just outside of Shanghai, uh, Actually, not far from uh, the Tesla factory there, ah, okay. um, in, in that same development technology development park. Yes. Um, and uh, brand new, beautiful building. We're very proud of it. Um, it, it will um, triple or quadruple our manufacturing capacity, mm -hmm. as well as greatly expand our R and D capabilities. So, right. uh, very, uh, we're very excited about it. We'll have a grand opening. Uh, at this point, planned for September of this year. Okay. So, I believe you've also uh, expanded into South Korea. That's right. And, and we've had a facility in South Korea uh, operating now for uh, about five years. Mm -hmm. um, but we're recently investing in expansion of that facility. Um, we've purchased land and we're moving forward with the design and build of a... a um, you know, a facility that is built specifically for our capability and for our uh, R&D and, and technology development. So. Okay, okay, excellent. Um, and then what are your plans? And uh, I believe you're also looking to do uh, some further expansion to the new place you just opened in November in, That's in right. Hillsborough. Oregon. That's right. So, um, again, we did a grand opening of our office in Hillsborough. Mm -hmm. um, we're looking at some additional clean room space in the Hillsborough area uh, that we sh hope to acquire sometime over the next three or four months. Right. Uh, and, and that will give us um, both demo capability and R&D capability uh, in Oregon. So we're, we're very excited about that. Yeah. Now, is that uh, the place where you're going to be able to do some of your advanced research down to the sort of uh, two nanometer and below? That's our intention, yes. Right, right. Okay. Now, what's happening on the product front? Because I believe you've also been working on, on, on that. Yeah, good, good question. So, um, in addition to cleaning technology, um, which you know is, is a, really our big growth opportunity, our, our growth potential, um, we're also using the things we've learned from building those tools, both the the hardware, the mainframes, and the software, to expand into some new areas that we think are high growth areas. Mm -hmm. uh, one of them is PECVD. Um, one of them is high temperature uh, furnace. Um, we also have ECP, which we've actually been doing a long, quite a long time, but now we're releasing it as more of a high volume product. Uh, so uh, all of those things are opportunities where we, we see significant growth. So what, where, where are you specifically using PECVD? Uh, what applications? So we're going to, our intention is to enable um, 3D NAND manufacturers to have um, more layers um, to, you know, again, really support AI and uh, the, the use of 3D NAND a across the, the industry. So, right, right. Wow, that's a pretty exciting development. Uh, uh, so, so that that technology is currently available now. It's it's it's, it's yeah. It, we, we, it. It, we're we're using it, and we've sold systems. Mm -hmm. um, it's not in volume manufacturing yet, right. but um, I would suspect within the year 
uh, it will go into volume manufacturing. Right. Okay. Well, you're certainly a busy guy, Jim. You've been <laughs> that's, a lot, that's a lot to happen in 12 months. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we're looking forward to it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so. Uh, I, I, I'm excited for you, and uh, I certainly uh, want to thank you for coming in and telling us about it today. It was a pleasure. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. thank you.